Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another beautiful video on this beautiful channel, this beautiful day. How you guys and girls doing? Please check out the description box, all the nice links down there. Uh, Twitter, Discord, drop a like, subscribe if you like the content that's about to be shown to you. So, let's just get started here. Um, we had a little problem with uh, GUI functions. So I added a little thing here where it checks if the symbols that are full are less than zero or the symbols that are empty are less than zero. Otherwise, you'll get a string crash here. We'll say X string and there will be some kind of problem because symbols full or symbols empty will be less than zero and you cannot add create a string with less than zero symbols, obviously, because it's just an array with characters and an array cannot be less than zero, right? So, uh, yeah, there you go. Pretty much just add this, these two, add a check for these two and you should be fine okay shouldn't be a problem and then you won't get that crash now what I want to do in this video uh, pretty much just fix some stuff go into event and I want to make sure where I create the enemy I usually I notice that they have a little bit too much of a uh, of a defense value so it's a, they're a little too strong in the defense so if I go into enemy.cpp I should be able to uh, look at this so times four I'm just gonna I'm just gonna chill out with that accuracy is fine defense a little too hardcore so I'm just gonna chill with that HP is good HP is good damage is good uh, as well as drop chance which I'm not using right now but that's pretty much good so I just added a four there instead and we'll see how that how that turns out uh, I got the main menu uh, also the you are dead thing I'm just gonna do a uh, GUI menu item no menu title you you are dead load uh, then we'll do a menu item uh, C out also you need the C outs here C out GUI menu item zero is going to be yes and then we're gonna do another menu item here one is gonna be no and then we'll get the choice we'll do all of this we'll get choice and else a string stream menu do I have that already I have menu string okay so I'm just gonna copy this uh, menu string menu str so make sure we clean all these things up makes it a little easier on us uh, remove that and then get choice this choice uh, menu str dot str stream size one Okay, and then depending on the choice, we will do some stuff. So it's kind of a sub-menu down here. And that just shortened it up, made the code look a little nicer. So just make sure you do that. Uh, level up available. Menu string. UI alert. Uh, level up available. Maybe I'll use that as the alert and then yeah pretty much pretty much pretty much looking nice here uh, GUI menu title cool 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 now let's go into the create new character looks fine uh, character name error so I'm just gonna use the error here GUI uh, what was it? Character already exists. GUI error. Character already exists. Alright, I'm just going to use all caps and then we're going to do the character name again until until we get it working. Um, and maybe a system pause down here. Just make sure. And that's cool. Alright, level up character. I think it should be cool. Uh, you have stat points to allocate and then I'm just gonna do a little let's see let me string get choice 
I'm just gonna do GY menu title 2 you have stat points to allocate okay and then like this and stat to upgrade should be a GUI I'm kinda just winging it here menu title 2 stat to upgrade um, like this or stat to upgrade and then GUI menu item zero string strength I'm just gonna copy paste this just about four times one two three strength vitality dexterity and then intelligence let's just remove the rest and then we'll get a choice here as well and get choice this choice and menu str.str I'm gonna create that no don't worry and then we'll just do this um, string stream menu str and just put that everywhere instead of the C outs and you should be fine alright and then we can get the choice in here from the stats okay add to stat choice actually I just need one why do I have this I don't know get choice add choice um, this choice so I'll add one to whatever I pick of these okay now if choice this choice is greater or equal to or greater than three or this choice is less than zero which is pretty much how many of these we have then we're just going to do c out c out gui uh, oh wait you know what the last thingy was pretty good because it it made sure we couldn't let's see we will need a while here because otherwise um, you know what let's go back let's let's do it like this look if choice is greater than three or less or while okay that means that we're not getting the correct correct choice and then we'll just say C out GUI error no such stat uh, no such stat whatever we'll just we'll just say something like that no such attributes we'll just say that and then we'll do the get choice again with that same menu string and then we'll print that out while it's less than zero or greater than three and then at the end we'll do that so let's just try this uh, boom everything looks fine let's travel to gain the XP uh, you know what we could do we could just give the character I could just go in here and I could cheat and I'm gonna give him um, 49 I think I'm gonna give him 2000 3000 exp and then I will load it again let me just see how long it has been okay cool so let me just load this again and I have a bunch of XP. See, it didn't crash now I do have this is a little too much it's a little too much um, and I'm gonna have to fix that 
I don't know why that happened, but that's that's okay. It doesn't really matter. Um. Well, I do have an idea why that happened, but I'll fix that later. Anyway, level up. Let's just go ahead and do a level up, and then we'll see stat to upgrade. All right, that looks pretty cool though. I I, I do like that. That looks pretty cool. I just need to add this to as an alert. Uh, you have a stat point to allocate, stat to upgrade, and then we're gonna do six. Okay, no such attribute. You have a set point to allocate. Uh, strength, strength increased. All right, and if we go into, all right, now it looks fine. Now it's back to normal. Okay, level up again. Won't be able to. Not enough exp. All right, cool, cool. So that that works. It didn't crash. At least it didn't crash. Um. Uh, let's see. Less than zero. Let's add one more fix. If symbols full is greater than uh, max length. I'm used to Lua here, so I'm not doing this properly. If symbols, and I'll just do a else if here. Symbols full equals max length okay we'll just copy paste this put it below here symbols empty symbols empty okay so now you shouldn't run into that problem pretty sure you shouldn't and that's good we're good all right we're good to go we're good to go uh when we do level up you are level level should do that as an alert Okay, GUI functions. Let me just go into alert quickly. Now let's add a few more spaces to that and error as well. So we should have about four, just about a tab. Yeah, just about a tab. Tab inwards. Um, and I'll just do a new line before as well, just to make it extra, extra clear. Uh, new line before as well. Okay, so that that looks cool. That looks cool. I, I like that. I like that. That's really nice. And then we can have not enough XP or not. We can all fix that with alerts and stuff later on. Um, boom, boom, boom. Add to stat. Strength increased. Okay. All right. Cool. We'll we'll just fix this later on with the printout. It's not that important. The most important part of all this is working. Uh, we can. Uh, Kind of use flasks and stuff like that. So that's uh, that's that's very nice. That is very very nice. Um, yeah, yeah, pretty much, pretty much. Let me see. Just before we get before we get started here, before we get going, let me see. There, where is where is event CPP right here? Okay. All right. Yeah, I think everything is everything's fine pretty much. All this we did try all this. It, it does it does work. And it does help us out. Let's just run this one more time before we get going. Let's do a travel. Obviously me. Enemy turn. Alright, so player roll for nine missed. Attack. Let's attack. See the defense is a lot lower now, which is which is nice. I do like that. Enemy defeated. Enemy percent, player percent. I had a lower percent. Still, I kicked his ass. So, uh, weapon drop. Cool. Then, that enemy missed me. Let's attack again. Alright. I did defeat that enemy. Boom. Easy peasy. Now, I got a bunch of EXP here. Let's level up again. To uh, vitality or dexterity, I think. Dexterity increased. Level up one more time. Uh, level up intelligence I guess I'm pretty sure if we're going to character sheet now I should be seeing uh, 11 defense all that stuff okay cool 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 back save this dude all right let's load him up looks good looks fine no problems uh, cool there we go guys and girls thank you so much for watching it's been nice it's been fun 
we kind of clean stuff up got stuff working and now you shouldn't have any crashes so but thank you for watching hope you learned something take care check out the description box drop a like subscribe if you like the content and i'll see you guys and girls in the next one all right bye bye